So uh, what first, first thing I'm going to show you is just kind of uh, what you first see when you first create uh, a new custom code action. So right here, we just have a, a blank workflow. Basically, it just has the trigger for the deal. So we're going to come over here and we're going to go over to, to the custom code button. And so that's going to open up the custom code editor. And there's three important things that you want to look at right here. The first one is secrets. That's where you're going to manage your API keys. And that will allow you to make API calls to, to really anywhere. Right now, this, this, this happy key is our API key to our, our dev org or HubSpot. So that allows us to do API calls internally to get data about different objects. The second thing you have is you have your actual code. When you first create a new custom coded action, it comes with uh, some code already pre-built in here. And what this does right now is it just goes into the contacts. And so um, this is built for a contact and it will just get the, the email and the phone number, and then you can return those later. And that leads us to our last item, which is the outputs. You can define the different outputs right here. Right here, you can choose the data type. You can do strings, which are just like letters and then you can do numbers and all different sorts of things. And right here, if we come back up a little bit, you can see right here in the output fields, we have email and phone. So let's say you wanted to return that, that email output, you'd come over here to string, since it's just gonna be some letters and you'd do email, and you could save that. And then that way, you'd be able to access what those output fields were later on in the workflow. So I'm gonna come over here to our, our deal commission calculator which is, uh, has the same trigger. And we're just gonna kind of dive into the code a little bit. So you can see right here, we have it connected up to our happy key, which lets us do internal calls to HubSpot. And right here at the very beginning, um, this is where you can get, you can import your packages. Right now HubSpot has, I think 12 packages that, that you can use. And that allows you to import custom code libraries, which gives you some extra functionality inside the actual code. And I'll, I'll touch on those a little bit later once we get through the rest of the, the demo. And so what this basically does is we right here, we have our, our happy key, which creates a, a new client, which that allows us to make API calls within HubSpot. So this is gonna come over here and it's gonna make an API call to the deals. And what it's gonna pull is it's gonna pull the deal amount and whoever the owner is. So if we come over here, we can see we have our our deal that we're using. We have the amount right here, which is $800. And then we have the owner, which is me. And so how it's set up is each owner in HubSpot has a, a commission value or a commission rate. And so what this is gonna do is it's gonna make an API call to get that commission rate from whoever the, the owner is. And then it's gonna calculate that with the amount to figure out how much the commission is. So if we come down here, we have that first API call um, that I already touched on that gets the amount and the, the user ID. And then we're gonna make a couple other API calls to get the rest of the info. And so this one right here, if we come over to right here, here we have uh, another API call that's being made. And what this is gonna do is this is going to go in and it's going to pull the actual contact. So it's gonna go into HubSpot and it's gonna pull the contact to Caleb Dutson and then it's gonna find what the rate is of that contact. And then using that rate, we can calculate what the deal commission wants to be. And then right here, you can see we have our output field, which is the calculated commission. And if you come down here at the very bottom, you can see that it has a number output for the calculated commission. And why that's really nice, is like I said before, we can, we can close this editor. So now that value is going to be able to be used outside of the, the custom code action. So I'll just show you kind of what that looks like. If we come over here to copy property value, we can go to select the property. You can see right here that calculated commission value is something that we can access inside the workflow. So what we're doing is we're just using that to, to copy that calculated commission right into the, the commission field on the deal. And so I ran this, this workflow uh, before. And so let's uh, go ahead and refresh this page. And you can see that after that workflow ran, that it populated this commission right here. That's cool. And so that's, yeah, that's, that's the gist of it. It's, it's some really powerful stuff since you don't have to put it in any 
to any external systems. You can just do it all within HubSpot and that allows you to, to really kind of customize your, your CRM experience.